New at 10, tonight's Decatur City Council meeting accomplished two things. Approved new wording for the parade ordinance and opened the floor for Councilman Billy Jackson to call on Mayor Tab Bowling to step down. Take a listen. When Tab announced that two years out that he was not going to run for re-election, from that point on, in my opinion, it was paid retirement. People have talked to me and they, their question was very simple. How do we get rid of a mayor? And my answer has always been that there is no recourse. We can't get rid of a mayor. We can't. There is no recourse in the state of Alabama for us to do that. He's been elected. If there's an ounce of integrity, I would ask that your love for, you, for the city will allow you to step down and let someone else take that seat. No mincing words there. So Councilman Billy Jackson criticized the mayor for recently choosing to leave city council meetings during public comments. The mayor said it's become unproductive. Jackson even floated the idea of council president Jacob Ladner taking on the role and being more educated and qualified for it. Mayor Bowling announced last fall that he's not running for reelection. His term ends August 2025. Now, as for the parade ordinance, city leaders unanimously voted to remove a permit requirement for those picketing and protesting on public property and sidewalks. This follows confusion and frustration among protesters wanting to spotlight the police shooting death of Steve Perkins.